Hello, Mortals Meat Spike is fine, but you're not already. Uh, fucking heart gold, soul silver, not, not soul silver. Uh, randomizer Nuzlocke Beast is here. Damn! Randomizer Nuzlocke versus! Yeah. Uh, I got a fucking Torterra last time. And it has already the best moves, Beast. Mm. Do you know? What, do you remember what moves it has? Uh, I know it has Earthquake. I'm guessing it has Seed Bomb. And Sky Uppercut. It, I think it had... Was it Air Slash? Or am I thinking of another Torterra? You're thinking of another Torterra. Mine has uh, Nightshade, which is that one move that just does your level and damage. Which That's is, not that great. Is it really good for capturing shit? Yeah, it's, it's not that great. Halo Dynamic Punch! And That's a great TM. It's a great TM if you have something with no guard, because it's a 50 accuracy move. Time to see what I encounter over here in this water. Oh, uh, who's better for it, for this encounter for any encounters? I will tell you that Hippowdon is one of the encounters in this water on this route. Ew. I'm tempted to take a rod to this area. Fuck it. Hey, I didn't get the encounter yet. But uh, I will take these same horns. Between episodes, I went back all the way to Home City and withdrew all my money from the Mother Bank. And uh, I bought ultra, ultra Balls and Super Potions with it. He did that specifically 15 minutes before this episode. And I had to wait 15 minutes for him to do that. You're not supposed to tell them that. Well, if I have to deal with that crap, I'm gonna tell anyone I want. I cannot easily grind until I get to the EXP share. Uh, which is in Mahogany. Which actually is a thing I'm about, about yeah, to I do. I you can get to do it. I'm about to do the, ma the Mahogany thing with the Lake of Rage. Encounter! Encounter Jolteon. Good thing I have my graphics card out, which is Volt Absorb. I don't know how to weaken this, so I'm just gonna throw one of these balls that work better on things that are quick. The fastball. Because Jolteon is extremely fast. Alright. Are you ready to see what the level 30 possibly shiny is because I am which one where you mean the Gyarados the red Gyarados it's level 30 I mean I think I'm closer to getting there than you are no I was a square away from it oh it's a cradily though I'm guessing you didn't get a fight not for my encounter why didn't you use a repel I didn't have any <laughs> <laughs> oh, perfect. And then it's gonna be something horrible. Yeah. Like a like it's gonna be mega. It's just gonna be a Bidoof. Your name is now Poke. Um, as you are very prickly. Um, I don't. I don't... I got this fucking cradley though. That's not terrible. I just got a good grass type though. Ah, uh, hey, fisherman Tully. Hello, Mantine. That is level nineteen. But it's fine because if it is shiny, shiny claws. Since shiny claws. What if your first encounter of the route is shiny? Uh, it being your first technically negates the fact that you can use shiny claws on it. That's more of a uh, that's more of a logistics question. Yeah, that's why I asked it. I mean, it's up to us to decide the the rules and how they are initiated. Yeah. 
Yes, give me your phone number so I can grab items from you that you fish out of water. Give me that water stone that you probably will find. I'm pretty sure there's an item on that rock down there. Let me, let me go get it. I mean, if you think there's an item, there might be an item. I don't fucking know. It seems like the spot Pokemon would have an item. Hello, Max Potion. After you've played enough Pokemon, you just know where those yeah, items but are. but sometimes they have yeah. fake-out areas. Sometimes. Waterfall. Wait, what? Okay, I read that as Mount Monster, and I was like, this is Mount Mortar, what the heck? Yeah, there's uh, not no. two. There's not two roots tech in between uh, Alvine Mahogany, right? Or that one, I can't even remember the name of the place. I think it's Alvine. A critique. A critique. It's just one root, correct? Uh, this Pokemon's weird sometimes. There's technically two roots. There's the outside, which is a root number. Okay, num so, so I'm good. There's the numbered root, and then there's the inside, which is Mount Mortar. All these, like, level 17. So what is the shiny? I don't know. This cradle, you won't stay in the ball. It is a fossil Pokemon. Pretty sure that just makes it a pain in the ass yeah. to capture. I'm not throwing more than three Ultra Balls at it. I'm done. It's it's dead now. I'm not gonna catch it. It's not worth and then it. it. And then it's just an incredibly awesome Pokemon. And it's not shiny. You know what? I don't want to. I don't want to put anything out. Uh, I don't. I don't want to switch Pokemon to something else because then it's probably going to be up against something that's super effective and that I have to switch into and it just takes time. And I want that EXP share. Cradle, Wild Cradle, it does have Charge Beam though. That is interesting. All right, time to kill it. It, it didn't let me catch it. I think it has Swift Swim because it's raining and it just outsped my uh, Combuskin. And is supposed to be extremely slow. Yeah. I think it had closer to base 60 or it was lower. I think it's kind of fast for what types it is. I just don't think it was much higher than 60. Iron Head works for a Matang. I see no reason to worry about any other moves. I want to be fully healed when I fight this thing because it's level 30, but... Ugh. I'm so mad. Just You're in... so mad. Just in case that isn't a shine now. You run into it, it's a Rotata. <laughs> what is the most disappointing thing it could be, in your opinion, before you run into it? Uh... Fully evolved first root trash. <laughs> Is it really? No. I was I was answering your question. Okay, okay. I just for a second the tone made me think that you just ran into it. I think I got enough repels. All the grass leading up to that area counts as the same encounter. Uh, yeah, you'll see because once you actually get into the part that is the area with the D Gyarados in it, Sprite, the Gyarados Sprite, uh, it changes the, uh, area location to the Lake of Rage. So, are you saying that it is the same route or not? It's the, the all the grass leading up to the Lake of Rage is the same route. Hello! Oh my and, god! Uh, what is it? Hello, Raikou! Is that the encounter? No, <laughs> By the way, Raikou has snow warning. But, uh, you just ran into Raikou randomly, I assume? Yeah, just trying to walk back up there. Okay, because I'm pretty sure these... These, uh... If I was hunting for it, I could not run into, into it that often. <laughs> I haven't ran into a single one, and I think I've ground a lot more than you have. Kitty! That, move that, your that ass! Beast, that's the point of what I'm saying. 
If I was hunting for them, I could not run to them that often. I will pay 1,000 so I can skip some grass. It's not worth it. Uh, it is when you don't need to buy balls. Hello, Mr. Psychak. <gasps> Did I heal? Mid mid midnight. I I'm do know that there is usually a TM that gets given in that building after uh, you do the get after you do the Team Rocket HQ thing. Kitty, you better not knock out my wireless. I will get very mad. I will be, I will be very disappointed. It is. It would be very hard to get on my good side after that. I swear, if, I, I I just got ice fanged by a frost last. If it froze, I was gonna be so anger. <laughs> by the way, here I found the weeb frost lass boy. The weeb frost lass boy. I probably his fought him. Nido King was outstanding. I think it might be the one you talked about before. It might be. Uh, okay, Lake of Rage. This person. It is shiny. Heal, right? It is shiny. But it's an Ariados. Ooh. <laughs> I don't think Brian will kill it in the rain. From from being five levels lower. Okay, so you know what time it is. That X scissor did a lot of damage. What if it has huge power? That would be hilarious. I think I'm going... Okay, so Route 43 in Lake of Rage, it it pulls up the... Uh... Yeah. Like, so, Lake of Rage so is... you said before that they're different encounters. Are they? Yes, Lake of Rage is a separate area, so it's a separate encounter. Okay, so you well, get... before my... Uh, I didn't mean to say before that you said that before. I thought you meant... That you, if it meant that, I must not have... I must have rolled low on sense motive. Yeah. S Ariados is Red Gyarados. It's now the purple Ariados. Hey. Dose. 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 What's up, Dose? That, that X is doing a lot of damage. Think bug era. Steel resist bug in this gen. Air resist bug in every gen. Uh, not in Gen 1. Well, it doesn't exist in Gen 1! So does it resist anything in Gen 1, Kyle? Okay, this Ariados has Steel Wing, too. And I don't care about the other encounters, so I'm just gonna get the Ariados. I don't know, Cradle could be fucking good. Yes. But, Kyle. You don't seem to understand... Ground kills two-thirds of the things that I can use. Alright, so this got X Scissor, which does a shit ton of damage. Signal Beam, which does less damage. Wow, this thing's actually a little tanky. Ow! I don't want to brick break it, but it's gonna quad resist it. It, it quad resists it. Okay, it's got Sludge Bomb, Signal Beam, Steel Wing, and X Scissor. No, cut, missed! Sludge bomb, yes! You sludge bomb on this monstrosity, Matang. Don't crit X Scissor, please. Yay! I think Ariados is pretty fast. I have no fucking idea. <laughs> I've never used one. I didn't even know it had stats. Pretty sure code. <laughs> it has stats. Every Pokemon has stats, Kyle. What's wrong with you? I, I need to switch out. It's got... A lot of moves. <laughs> that are dangerous. I will throw an Ultra Ball. Wow, 
Wrathmonger, Wrathmonger, what is your defenses like? I like that. Oh no, Steel Wing. That's double resisted. Or actually, I think it's just single resisted. Psychic, yeah. Psychic doesn't resist steel. Yeah, that's why I was saying. Okay, use this fastball. I really don't want it to kill my uh, combustion, but if it crits uh, poison sludge bomb, it can very easily do that. One more fireball, go. Okay, if this X's or crits, it actually will hurt. Yeah, this thing is deadly. Not horribly so, just enough to make it a nuisance. Got it! I think I'm gonna have to cut it. <laughs> again. Whoo, <laughs> boy. <laughs> just keep using Sludge Bomb, Ariados. Just keep using Sludge Bomb. I do like the purple on it, though. That is better than the red. We gonna give you a little snips. Uh, what do I name a purple male Ariados? <laughs> <laughs> uh, Black Widow. It's male beast. Hmm. Well, you assume Black Widow spiders are all female. I'm gonna do a lure ball because it's in the water. Purely for the sake of of seeing a joke. I'm naming it Wander. Any particular reason? Brazilian wandering spider. You know how many spiders there are in existence? A uh, Brazilian wandering spider is the one that uh, gives you an out, gives you a one hour boner with its poison, and then you die. Probably the probably the most effective boner of your life. A very painful one. Yes, keep using Steel Wing. Maybe I can inch your health bar down a bit more if you, if you get that defense up. <laughs> that red Gyarados wasn't acting right. It looked like a spider over there. <laughs> <laughs> Go, Ultra Ball. Seems that the Lake caught. of Rage's magic harp are being a force to evolve into spiders. I caught an area dose, Kyle. Now, if it has huge power, it's a potential team member. Ah, uh, this thing's name is Wolf. I always say both named after types of spiders. Yeah, it's just I didn't I didn't segregate mine based on gender for its name. Well, I did that so I didn't end up naming it Charlotte. And now we immediately fly to Cherry Grove. No, to Violet City. Poison Heal. This poison type has poison heal. Mm hmm. It can't get poisoned. I'm gonna I'm gonna check mine just in case. I don't know if they I think they might get different abilities. Maybe. Oh, well, still level thirty. <laughs> Ooh! It had the item protector. It think... still had poison heal though. <laughs> Attack stat down, special defense up. Special attack down, speed up. Unfortunately, its speed is garbage. Ah, jolly. Yeah. 
Well, this is one that probably won't be used. I might use it. It's just got a Garbo speed stat. Why does Harry just have a low speed stat? I mean... It's a spider. I mean, I don't consider spiders slow by any means. They no. scurry around pretty damn fast. Now, uh, let's just watch this uh, Dragonite hyper beam a guy. Oh yeah, doesn't Lance appear near the lake after you exit the water? Yeah. I just flew away, so... <laughs> uh... Hopefully that doesn't screw anything up, although I probably would have heard about it doing that in other games. It doesn't screw it up, it's just you have to go back now. That's not, that's not a big deal, I had to go get a root encounter anyways. Now the important thing is, in the Team Rocket HQ... There's more encounters. More encounters? Yeah. We'll, that, well, that, I guess we'll see everybody next time. Well, I just activated a three-person fight. You can at least go talk you can at least go talk to Lance. I just got activated into a uh, triple battle, basically. Or it you fight three people one after the other. I just ended recording. I can't. Not yet. Ah, uh, we don't have to end it simultaneously. Alright. So if you want the true experience... <laughs> I think Team Rocket has electric types. Wasn't it that one time they just had whatever types? Just all of them had different types? I don't know. I just know that the first guy I fought had a Chin Chow and a Shinx. I think it's trainers individually are type themed. Yeah, so that's how I said it, but I don't know if Team Rocket's all gonna have the same type. Thank God, I have the EXP share. No, it's all different types. This guy's gonna have ground. Either way, I love my live my Torterra. So I got Seed Bomb for the ground, so I got Earthquake for the electric. Well, I think that Venusaur's attack and special attack are similar. They are. But its attack is higher. I think it's its special attack that's higher. That's what I meant to say. I'm pretty sure Nosepass is supposed to have a higher special attack. And I'm pretty sure Pidgey just doesn't matter. Uh, bird noises. Those aren't bird noises. It's time to give the EXP share to Silvasaur. I would at least still throw the uh, Arios in your party because it is level 30. <laughs> I have to grind three party members after this. And the Pidgey is an HM slave. Who only has fly right now. Can it learn Rock Smash? I don't know. Can't learn Cut, so at least when I get to the next town, I can take it off of the Matang. Alright, and I'll continue- yes. And I will continue with this Team Rocket HQ Headquarters Assault next time. <laughs>